What do you race for? Do you race for? Uh, Everything is good to go. It's just I talk, though, so that's how it just sounds and stuff like that. Alright, so basically it's going to be a month. You want to call it the month of horror. So it's going to be into Resident Evil Revelations. I haven't even, like I said, I bought the thing, but I haven't even really played it yet. <laughs> I guess I'm going to do a lot of stuff, so I'll be like back and forth, back and forth, and all this and that. run. I like when I try to do stuff fresh run because it gets me to, you know, agitate myself. We're gonna work on our green screen, son. Oh, shit. Hold on a second, everybody. Oh, we gotta go blue screen for a minute. Hold on, hold on. Oh, okay, cool. All right, leave it just like that. Um, blue screen, everybody. Hold on a second. Got to do something here. Hate doing that in the middle of what you gonna call it, but I, I, you know, we gotta have, we gotta have stuff working. We gotta have stuff popping. You know what I mean? Can't have this, have this going on. Oh, look at the thing. I think that'll do it. I don't know. I don't know how stuff goes. Alright, now we're back, y'all. I'm sorry. Let's put you on the blue screen. Man, I mean, you get all these gifts. I appreciate it. Oh, snap. Hey, hi. Oh, hi. Uh, oh, shit. We're going to go to the campaign. It's like I said, fresh run. 
you know what? Let's fuck it. Let's go to normal. Alright, do the quick turn. I think it's still basically on the same. Hopefully. Hey, G. It's been 94 minutes since Chris and Jessica dropped off the radar. But the interpolation from their last known coordinates puts them... Right here on the ship. abandoned for a while. Ugh, it smells like rotting flesh. No signs of life. Something's here. Hey! What? What happened? I don't think we're alone. There's blood coming from the ducks. Checking all the lock. <coughs> mm hmm. I'll so tell you. I'm checking lock. That's how they say, Trish. Yeah. It's 
short it out. <laughs> More like he did it as did that damn thing. The power still works here. Parker, give me a hand here. Sure, no problem. I got something. I think it's a gun. Now what? Give me a sec. More like Chris's gun. No. You should go dig your hand right in there. It'd be funny if you drop that blade on it. So, it's not Chris. You know, aren't you bummed? This explains our missing crew. This is not good. Where are you, Chris? Into the depths, y'all. Like I said, I'm gonna try to speak as loud as possible if I can. If not, don't even worry about it. You know, it's all about the gameplay. So can we start an episode? This sunny and idyllic Mediterranean coast was the site of one of the world's greatest structures. It took a full 11 years to finish constructing the world's first Aquapolis, the floating city of Terra Grigia. A sustainable metropolis operating on a massive solar energy matrix and equipped with the latest green technologies. Never before had solar energy been used to supply power to an entire city. But, oh, in Evil 2004, right. Veltro, a terrorist group opposing the city's development, the launched a bioterrorist attack. Right. You know, better quality. They not only released a virus, but also several creatures, known as bioorganic weapons, further complicating the situation. This launched one of the worst tragedies the world has ever seen. The FBC... The world's leading counter-bioterror organization, operating under the auspices of the U.S., was called in to direct efforts to contain the attack. The BSAA, a counter-bioterror NGO, which operates independently of the interests of any one country, went in as observers this, wonder, like, to assist the FBC. Realizing the need for immediate and decisive action, Supreme Local Headquarters issued the order to use the city's solar energy matrix on itself. 
we'll do that like media that. outlets around the world began to refer to the incident as the terror greedy panic more days left before Following the incident, the FBC that. announced it has successfully disbanded the terrorist group called Veltro. It is now 2005, and a sense of calm and security mm -hmm. is finally returning to the people. But, as you can see, the lost city of Terra Grigia remains inaccessible. A silent and potent symbol of the threat that bioterror poses for people around the world. All right, what I might do, um, I'm gonna have to adjust my microphone just in case it hears me more clear than what it is. Dog. Ah, there you two are. Oh, Brian, you don't normally join the fray. Well, my doctor told me I need exercise. <laughs> I assume you both know that the FBC has really cordoned off the entire area. However, in the past few weeks, a number of mysterious carcasses have washed up. I guess the FBC couldn't cover up a mess this big, huh? Anyone who knows what happened here is going to put two and two together. And that's why I've sent the BSAA in to investigate. Did you pick up your new equipment from Quint? Yeah. Genesis or something. Is that its name? You didn't bother to read the manual, did you? No. Uh, I brought it with me, just in case. I hope you read quickly, because you're going to need it on your mission. <laughs> yeah, I'm on it. You're gonna bring the manual out in front. Yeah. Hey, Chris. Alright. Genesis, the nickname of a high level bioscanner. Currently being tested and developed by the Global Fair Pharmaceutical Construct Consortium. It bounces special synchro synchro uh, radiation at the target in order to analyze it. I'm, uh, I'm tired, y'all. Viral analysis is possible to detect and analyze even the smallest amount of viruses. Vaccine manufacturing. Since version 1.0.4, it has been possible to produce simple vaccines from the viral analysis data. Using uh, radiation, it is possible to detect specific objects, the data for bullets, medical herbs, etc. are registered within the internal memory for testing. If a detachable object is detectable object is near nearby, the indicator in the lower right area of the monitor will light up. Like I give a crap. Okay. Um hang on a second everybody. Blue screen I mean yeah. Blue screen for a minute, y'all. I have to adjust my microphone. Um, Where's this thing of a jigger? And I'll keep doing this in the middle of the damn broadcast. Uh, audio sharing. Where's the audio button? One more time, man. Not share. Hang on. Because I'm trying to work on my microphone at the same time. Um, audio, 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 audio. Mm, device, device. Should have had this prepared, but like I said, you know, you just waking up and stuff. All you control. This microphone level. The reason why I had to get the microphone popping. Okay. All right, back to the gameplay. Finally. Ah, look at this mess. Oh, they're rotted to hell. And then hold. Okay. 
The Genesis requires a decent sample size to get an accurate reading. Scan the carcasses on the beach and send me your data. Get me a hundred percent analysis. Have a look at this. Oh, hold on, hold on. Chill, bro. I'm getting something from inside it. Careful now. Don't worry. I've done this before. Don't worry. I've done this before. I've got something. This is gonna hold your hand on down slow. What is this? It's a C virus. If it's an engineered mutation, this could prove a link. I'll run some tests on this. Continue with the investigation. Okay, I did that one. Shot that one. To Raccoon City. This must be a cakewalk. I suppose. So why'd you quit the FBC for this outfit? I wanted to be more involved. I wanted to fight. I see you two are okay. Continue with the investigation, but proceed with extreme caution. No, you want no choice but to proceed with extreme caution. Must have ruptured from gas. Christ, what a mess. She's R1. And we can carry two or more items. Oh, we need more samples to run an analysis. Give me a few more. You're a lot of bullets, but I'll tell you that much. Gather some more samples from the carcasses on the beach.
think it was like one more. Yeah. I've collected enough samples. Good. Get them to me ASAP. Where's the run button? Okay, there was no run button. Gotta be careful. I think one of these will come to life. Oh. Shit! Don't these things stay dead? Peace and quiet. All in a day's work for you two, eh? All right, enough chit chat. Get that sample data to me. Yeah, hopefully, no more samples attack me. God damn it. about it. These corpses show signs of viral infection. And I bet it's no coincidence they came through the FPC's blockade. Well, we did all we can. Now, we wait for the results to come back from HQ. Huh? It's the emergency line. Yeah, it's me. Uh-huh. What? Yeah, it's me. Yes, that's fine. I'll take it from here. We'll have to speed things up. Starting now. Uh-huh. Good. Get to it. Jill, Parker. You two are still on the case. What happened? We lost contact with Chris and Jessica. When? How? We're not certain. I've sent their last known coordinates to your terminals. The signal was lost over the ocean. Dun, dun, dun. I thought they were it's in the mountains lost. chasing Feltro. But judging from their position, they must be... On a ship. If I sent your last known coordinates. Go back to HQ. Take charge of the search and rescue. You two will be my eyes out there. Yes, sir. They had to, you know, they had to have the forefront of the foreshadow when stuff goes down like this. Yeah, so again, I apologize. Oh. Of course, you're gonna give me the first chapter easily. So that was episode one, y'all. Basically, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to just stop there. Um, I'm going to probably do something else. Matter of fact, I'm going to play some random Resident Evil 4. Why not? No, we're going to new game Resident Evil 4. That way, it's, it's a little bit different. 
like I said, Month of Horror Gaming, Dom Tracer Senpai. Like I said, give me a couple minutes.